Home Motor Spirit and Mobile Oil present Mobile Quest 1952. <laughs> Very good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We bring to all Australia the sixth and last semi-final of the Vacuum Oil Company's 1952 Mobile Quest. For nearly six months now, you've heard the best of Australia's young singers competing for a place in the grand final of Australia's greatest vocal contest. And so tonight, the Vacuum Oil Company and your local white mobile service station proudly present the last four semi-finalists. And we begin by welcoming once again the conductor of the Australian Symphony Orchestra and director of Mobile Quest, Hector Crawford. <laughs> Our first competitor is a bass from Ashfield, New South Wales. A welcome for Ellen McEachran. Alan McEachran won the 16th heat of the Vacuum Oil Company's Mobile Quest. Well, Alan, after the program on that occasion, you told me you were due for your annual holiday. How did you spend it? Very eventfully, John. Oh, how was that? Well, Dad and I decided on a 2,000-mile trip through the outback in our car. Hmm. We drove up the New South Wales coast and crossed the border into Queensland. Yes. On the way back, the wheels slipped on a narrow road and the car dived into a creek. Oh, Lord. Any serious damage? No, but it was a bit wet. I bet it was. You know, isn't it amazing how that sort of thing always happens on a holiday? Well, now, what are you going to sing for us tonight? Within These Sacred Bowers. Thank you. Within These Sacred Bowers from Mozart's opera, The Magic Flute, is sung by Alan McEachran. Like these 
thy heart can share. Then bide a willing pilgrim here. It seems like these thy heart can Sacred Bars was sung by Ellen McEachran of New South Wales. Now, ladies, if you've not yet received a copy of the 64-page Laurel Recipe Book and Household Guide, just send your name and address to the Vacuum Oil Company in your capital city, and a copy will be sent to you free and post-free. And now the second competitor tonight, she's a, a singer who sang in the 14th heat of the Vacuum Oil Company's Mobile Quest. A mezzo-soprano from Escotville, Victoria. Ladies and gentlemen, Marjorie Harrison. Marjorie, um, you were married last year, weren't you? Yes. Tell me, have you found a house yet? No, John. We gave that up in disgust. Mm -hmm. We decided to build our own instead. <laughs> Did you? Well, you know, I think we should change the name of this program to Home Builders Quest. We've had so many singers. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm afraid our house wouldn't win a prize yet, John. Uh -huh. Yes, we moved in several months ago, but it's still not finished yet. Well, good luck to you. I'm sure it'll be fine. You still find time for singing? Oh, yes. Uh, what's your song for tonight? Softly Awakes My Heart. Good. Marjorie Harrison of Victoria sings Softly Awakes My Heart from Samson and Delilah by Saint-Saëns.
My Heart was sung by Marjorie Harrison of Victoria. Our next competitor is a young tenor from Northcote, Victoria, the winner of heat number 17. Ladies and gentlemen, Noel Spark. <laughs> Welcome again to Noble Press, Noel. How are things with you? Oh, not so bad at all, John. Working hard as usual. You're in the engineering trade, aren't you? That's right. I work for the Commonwealth. Hmm, confidentially, I think we all do. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, Noel, what are you singing for us tonight? I'd like to sing Lohengrin's Farewell. Right. Noel Spark of Victoria sings Lohengrin's Farewell from Wagner's opera Lohengrin. Oh. 
Victorian tenor, Noel Spark. Now, ladies, unfortunately, you can't use magic to do your housework, but you can use the next best thing, laurel kerosene. And woman's work is so much easier and more effective with laurel kerosene, the greatest helper I've ever had in my home. Laurel, the best cleanser available, is at home in every room of the house, making dirt and grease disappear like magic. In the kitchen, laurel keeps the sink and lino always brightly shining, the windows too. And in the laundry, a few drops of laurel on a rag makes your copper or washer absolutely gleam. When you use laurel, your bathroom's the envy of all your friends. Mine is, with the bath, basin and other porcelain ware so fresh and sparkling. Laurel, the all-purpose kerosene, is also the ideal fuel for all kerosene-operated equipment. Heaters, refrigerators, lamps, stoves and hot water services. And I must tell you this. There isn't a cosier place than our lounge on a cold night with our modern kerosene heater fueled with laurel, Australia's finest kerosene. There's no smoke, soot or smell with laurel, and it's so economical too. I really don't know what I'd do without it. Thank you. And now finally, we hear a soprano from Mascot, New South Wales, the winner of the ninth heat. Ladies and gentlemen, Marjorie Conley. Well, uh, you're the second Marjorie on the programme tonight. <laughs> Tell me, do you work or do you study music full-time? Oh, well, I'm a bookkeeper in my father's office. Oh, neither. What does your father do? Oh, he's a, very, he's a master baker and a <laughs> very kind one, too. Mm -hmm. He gives me lots of time off the singing practice. Oh, good for him. I see you've chosen a very popular aria tonight, Marjorie. Yes, John, it's one of my favourites, Our Forze Louis. And a favourite of many listeners, too. Here now is Marjorie Conley to sing Our Forze Louis from La Traviata by Verdi. 
Oh, <laughs> 
La Traviata was sung then by Marjorie Conley of New South Wales. The other competitors in this, the sixth and last semi-final of the Vacuum Oil Company's 1952 Mobile Quest, were Noel Spark and Marjorie Harrison of Victoria and Alan McEachran of New South Wales. Now, while our adjudicators are making their decision, let me remind you that Laurel is the finest kerosene you can buy, and a wise housewife always keeps two four-gallon tins of Laurel kerosene on hand. One for use, and one for emergency. And now for those who may have missed last week's announcement. In addition to the £1,000 first prize, the winner of this year's Mobile Quest will receive a radio set donated by Chrysler, a free passage from Australia to Italy, given by the Lloyd Triestino shipping line, and, through the generosity of the Government of Italy, an audition at the Centre for Lyrical Advancement at Florence. And the finalists who will compete for these grand prizes on Wednesday the 3rd of September are, from Victoria, Joyce Simmons, Loris Sutton, Eric Mitchelson and Robert Allman, from Queensland, Donald Smith, and from New South Wales, Elizabeth Allen and Patricia Church. And, of course, tonight's winner. And here it is. The adjudicator's decision. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of tonight's semi-final is the soprano from Mascot, New South Wales, Marjorie Conley. The broadcast of the sixth semi-final of the 1952 Mobile Quest was compared by John Curtis. The broadcast presentation was by Roland Strong, and the Australian Symphony Orchestra was conducted by Hector Crawford, director of Mobile Quest, which comes to you with the compliments of the Vacuum Oil Company and your local mobile service station. <laughs> Remember, Laurel is the finest kerosene you can buy.